really for this practice to work, for it to go well, for us to get the most out of it, I have to talk so little. So just please let me say the messages once, I'm in, I'm out. The inactive fullback, so we've three fullbacks, Lucas, Nate, and Cashel. The one that's not active at the moment will just go goalkeeper for us, okay? Right, so to start, Nate, will you go goalie? Good man. Okay, so back for it then is Demo on the right, Kai left, Lucas left back, Cashel right back. Connor, you're playing as the six, and Ross, you are the ten. Okay, so we'll explain the functions now. The other guys, what we'll have actually, sorry, just explain. The yellows are going to be like a 4-4-2, but there's no four defenders, so it's four across the middle. So actually, Ebes, will you go lefty? Go left mid? Yep. And then what we'll do is Frenchie and Gurks in the centre, and then we'll have Jack out on the right. So guys, what we're going to do to start is a bit of orientation, meaning we're going to put the ball somewhere, and yellows are just going to set up as how they would defend. And we'll do that for each of the pink positions, okay? And then we'll get inactive play. So don't be going mad, rushing tackles and pinks. Don't ping the ball yet, just until we say where to put it, okay? So how we want to do this, guys, is we're going to set up in a, what's called a high block. Four yellows are the yellow, you, you hear me, yeah? And what we want to do with that block, guys, is block passes coming through midfield and block people dribbling through midfield. So in order for us to do that, like last Sunday, we're going to have to be very compact, both this way and this way, vertically and horizontally. So what we'll do, guys, put the ball down to start, if you would, Nate. We'll just play the ball out to Kai, okay? And what we're going to do is just freeze. Kai, take a few steps. He's noticed no one's come on him. Good stuff, Kai, and freeze. So what we're going to do at that point is, Ebes, you're going to be right over in line with the Egaki, the centre of the pitch. So it's very important that our two centre mids are always directly behind the ball. So that, exactly, shifting all the way, nice and compact. And then Jack, he's not over, he's not a threat yet, because what would happen there, look, a split pass in that gap. But you now just come a bit more and check your distance. So the distance you guys want to be apart, that's good, is that by the, ball, by the time that ball travels, either one of your feet would block that. All right, so you comfortable? I think that's a good picture for me, yep. You're probably over a bit too much, but that's fine at the moment. Okay, so Lucas is quite deep at the moment. That's all right. But let's just say you just push a bit high for us. Lucas, no pressure, and that's okay there. So when the ball travels to Lucas, boom, good. Whoa, good. We're going to shift over, and now Jack engages, and we shift over a bit more. Now, what's going to happen here is, is there's two important, important functions for these players. Our two strikers, one always covers the six, and the other one goes to the centre-back. All right? So we'll explain what that means now. So we'll just go back to Kai. Yeah, just pass the ball back to Kai. Your man, Lucas, bear with me, buddy. Okay, and hold. So we want to let them progress up a bit because if we go in there, they get their keeper, they play that way or out. We want to eliminate the goalkeeper and how we do that is actually by letting them come out a bit. So just drop off, just midfield as well, just drop off, good. So Kai, we've allowed that centre back of the other team to have a bit more, good, okay. So what would happen from here is this. The first two strikers, Jack, you'll be up top as well in this system, right? So just have a look. Maybe Ebes and Gurko the same. Actually, definitely. So the right side striker would close down here. So you would just go to close on that slowly, yeah, because you want to invite him out a bit. And you, what you would do is cover the six on the front. So where you in our system, we're used to going behind a player like this, aren't we? The strikers are just going to go in front of them and screen it. That's all it is. Because let's just say, Demo just come a bit closer. Yeah. Let's just say he pings across the demo, right? And just hold it. Now wrong tree leaves Connor, and then you screen Connor in the middle like that. Exactly. And then as we do, shift over. And remember, two centre mids, just always behind the ball. Good. And now as the ball travels to Casho, as the ball travels, we press, but not, not any other point. If he's taken a good first touch, we might want to be careful. If it's a big bouncy ball, bad first touch, we may want to punish, okay? but we've got to be shift over like that so that if there's any bounce back here, there's no way to pass through those gaps. All right? So, Ross, your function in this is pinks, any pink player is trying to score in any of those three nets at any time. All right? Your function, Ross, is to try get a pass in a gap between any of those players. Yeah? Okay? Right, so we go back, go back to the start. 
we'll play again. Okay? And we just be alive and alert to it. You ready? So you don't need to go deep, Kai, because no one's chasing you in there. There we go. And play. Good. So shift, yeah. Good. Good. Cover up. Well done, Jack. Okay. So. So if we can remember, Gurko for the same, Ebs the same, Jack the same. Keane was the centre back press, wasn't he? And then Ronchi was the cover. Whoever does the centre back press, what's important for you to do? Do you think? Yeah, because if they get it there and they switch, that's a lot of running for us and they may get into our half and even get a cross in. So if you stop that switch, then what's that called then? A pressing trap, exactly. Trap is where we press, a trigger is when we press, okay? Pardon? Uh, yeah, exactly, to eliminate, no, curving the run, blocking the fullback pass into the centre back. Okay, you ready, Nate? And play. Boom, okay, they're staying this side. Round three covers that six. Boom. Hold well on. And we shift, 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 shift. And Ross is just, don't let Ross get in any of them gaps. Well done. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, good, he's going across. Shift over, shift over. Don't let him go back, Keen. Don't let it go back. Well done. Now punish yellow. Okay, well done. For now, don't. Right, but in a match, you'd probably have that level of that cleverness. Well, I want these guys just to adapt, adapt on that. Okay. Now, the urge, guys, for the centre mids in a match would be what? On him would be what? The urge will be to drop off. And that's when we leave huge gaps for people to get through, dribble, pass, cross, receive. But by having a block, the system is, there's no passes to him, so he's not, he's not causing us a problem. Well then, the centre backs will only be about 15 yards away. So if it's in the air, they have to read that. Okay, all right, but good question. So Alex asked, what happens if he clips it over your head? The centre backs would only be a few yards away. So they can make that risk to go in there. And you, by the time that's in the air, how many yards are you away? Exactly. You're only about six, seven yards away. So two years could even meet that and put it off. Okay. And play. Okay, they got it. Boom, shift, shift, shift. Aye, well done. Okay. Now, yellows. Right. It's good that we shift. Look, as we shift though, can we shift but just keep coming? Because if we eliminate Nates, right, the, the press and trap will be more, there'll be more opportunity for press and traps and less danger for a switch, okay? So let's just sit off a bit. You ready? And play. Yeah, yeah, shift, shift. Nothing in the gaps. Now. Yeah, now don't let it come back, round three. Keen, cover, Connor. Boom. On that, on that touch. I'll take that. See that touch, that, yeah. Nice and aggressive in there, okay. Now, I'll just go back to the game, guys. So, Keen, round three. See when it's on a fullback. You're looking at the fullback, but the centre back is dropping, dropping, dropping. And then by the time you think you've covered, he's gone. So just keep scanning. Has he dropped more? And then just cover it because we'll box him in there. As Jack, now we're active. As soon as it travels to him, go in and challenge, okay? You ready? And play. Boom. Let him come. Okay. Boom. Punish. Okay, well done. Well done. Okay, oh, yeah, yeah keep it settled. Play. Now you give us cover in the middle, Frenchy. Yeah, just cover in the middle. Cover in the middle because if it's lost here, yeah, exactly. There you go. Okay, and hold. So, right, maybe it's because, like in training, we forget that there's a bottom half of the pitch. We actually do not want to press them in that box unless it's a bad touch. Invite them out, okay? Invite them out and they'd be less, honestly, there'd be less pressure for us by eliminating that goalkeeper, okay? And play. 
Remember, Pinks, we just need to score on that goal. Well done. Yeah, and keep talking about... Shift, shift, shift. Over to that one. Don't let him play it. Yes, yeah, Eves. Well done. Okay, give him a sec, give him a sec, give him a sec, because that would have been a throw in, so give him a second to get over. Oh, pardon? Yeah. Yeah, leave him. Leave him. Because again, we're happy for them to have it up there. It's only when they want to progress to the edge of the third. See the, where the box is? That's where we need to be aggressive and tight. Okay, now, it's very important, midfielders, just keep an eye on him, because if Ross moves here, and he's in that channel, then he moves there. Just tell Gurks or tell Gurks, tell French, or Eves the same. Just ha let him know, because you need to be aggressive in those moments, all right? Okay, I'm playing. Boom. Let him come, let him come. Naked creep up. All right, punish, well done. Time, time, time. Well done. Okay, good stuff guys, and hold. So what we'll do now is, Connor, have you swap with Demo, but Demo swap with Ross. Ross, you go in that six roll, okay? So you're all the same color. So Demo, you actually go up as the 10, receiving it between the lines, yeah? And then what we'll do is, Nate, will you swap a casual, please? You're actually like the number 10, the striker of the team. So you just want to get in those gaps, turn and score. All right. Yeah. All right, and then what was it? Yeah. All right, guys. And play. Good, yeah. Just keep an eye on that, yeah. Boom, that's a trap. Don't let him come back. Boom. Keep it in, keep it in. Play. Punish that. Hey, free kick. 